guys, it's me, your girl Yodiko here, and I am back with some Sims. A new LP, if you will. So, I know you're thinking, Shanice, you barely added the ones that you got. But hear me out. We're gonna just add a new one in the mix because we need something else going on, and I need something else in the rotation to so that I can stay excited and ready. So, just deal with me for now. This is AB Story. This is our girl, Audrina Barnes. And she goes by AB. So like Amy, but with a B. So AB. And not Abby. Because her name's Audrina and she just uses her initials. She is a, uh, I think she's a translator. I think that's her job. She's been out of college, so we're not doing no college or anything like that. Um, and she just moved into the city. And for me, this is kind of like maybe a rags to riches type story. So it's literally... I don't want to say it's similar to Lily's world, but it's going to just be about her in a more rags to riches where Lily was a more college based LP in the beginning. And now she's a more, I'm an established career woman. She, this girl is literally trying to establish herself. We can say she's about 27, 26, 27 years old. But right now we have our girl Audrina. She's having a beer and she's reading a mystery book called Crisis Barn by Jim Scuttleson. But the other day we did take her out to the bar um, because she applied to join a club, the party house, and she got in. So I think our goal is for her to really step out her shell. She's going to try to overthrow Jade and take over the party house but for right now. She's just cooling it. She's just reading. So let's just relax with that girl for a little bit, okay? When the love comes around and then I remember All things must pass But I'm not gonna wake up, wake up I'm not ready, let me have another day Don't wake up, wake up Keep it steady cause I'm happy I'm not gonna wake up must pass but i'm not gonna wake up wake up i'm not ready let me have another day don't wake up wake up keep it steady cause i'm happy i'm not gonna wake up has woke up um and what we need to do is i forgot about her job uh -huh. function Girl, eh? so we definitely need to head to the library to research interpretation techniques she's currently a phone interpreter 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 not interpreter interpreter at $22 an hour, she works Monday through Thursday, 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. So what I'm going to have her do, She had went, when she went to the bar, she had stole some food. So she's going to grab a servant of some of the food she stole. <laughs> they had some caterers and stuff. And she was like, mm, I'm, I got $18. I got $18. 
So we stole some food. Um, and then I'm going to have her make her a cup of coffee because she is a coffee fanatic. So we're going to go ahead and do that. She does have a good reputation. She doesn't have any fame right now. I don't know if that's something that I want her to do that even if she gets it, I might remove it. Um, and just so you can get to know her, she loves children, but lo and behold, she does not want a child right now. She, that's not something that she's looking for, looking to do. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn on the music. And I'm going to say she loves her some hip hop. So we're going to turn on some hip hop. And then she loves children. She's a coffee lover. Once again, stunning, free spirit, lighthearted, incredibly friendly, alcohol heavyweight, well balanced, compassionate, great kisser. Just read, 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 pause and read, pause and read. This one is, I think, cute. Oh, just stunning again. She does have survival instinct. Um, anything that is particular, she's a lover and a jester, but that changes so much that it, who cares? You know, she already went to the bathroom. Um, we'll have her brush her teeth afterwards. So I'm going to have her come here and just watch some TV. We'll put the coffee there for right now. Can you come eat this, love? Eat this damn food. We'll put her coffee there and she'll drink her coffee afterwards. Uh, This volume is loud. Okay, so once she finished that, I'm gonna have her drink her coffee as well. What was the thing of this? Oh, nice. Oh, Agatha Crumplebottom. Thanks for the meal. So she's just watching some TV, eating her food. Got her bonnet on. She's so pretty. I feel like my Sims starting to look the same, but I don't care. I, this is a look, okay? I love it. I love Audrina. I'm in love with her already. Okay, so another thing that we wanna do with Audrina is we do wanna find her love, but to be honest, it's not high on her list. Um, right now it's her, we, we're really going to try to overthrow Jade in this. And then I want to kick out everybody and make her own group. <laughs> Instead of her making her own club, I want her to take over someone else's club and then kick everybody out. Kick the people out that she doesn't like the most. So I'm probably going to, her and Jade's relationship is probably going to go down really fast, really soon. Yes. Little music in the background. This cooking show crazy. And then she got her little fish Rudy in the background or Ruby, Rudy or Rudy? Rudy or Ruby? I said Rudy or Rudy. All right, so she's gonna change her clothes and then we are going to go try to find a library somewhere. All right, so we made it to the Laurel Library in uh, Brychester. So this is where we are. Oh. I was right on here. Oh, okay. So yes, we're at the library so that she can go ahead and research her interpreter skills. First things first, we are going to come into this library and go straight to this computer and the only thing I can think where it may be is web research oh child let's look at it again research interpretation techniques oops did not mean to do that ah oh, i didn't want to do that um well damn so she's just answering some work emails and doing the one thing that she had to do for work. It gave her $176 for it. So she may treat herself to a nice Starbucks drink and um, purchase a book or two. Yeah, she, I think she likes reading. I think so. Girl, you're checking these work emails aggressively. They must be in there. She checking them work emails like they got her fucked up. 
crazy. Okay, Ivy. Okay, so Audrina, work for Audrina starts in about an hour. What would you like to do? Maybe we'll work from home for today and then I'll send her on tomorrow. So let's work from home for today and let's see how that goes. Anywho, let's go back and let's purchase these books. So that means she technically doesn't have to go home yet. She can do some of her work here. I do want her to purchase a book or two. Um, she likes mystery books. So we know she has Crisis Barn. Ooh, that one sounds like her. The Swift and the Angriest. Ooh, let's get that one. The Night the Moon Forgot to Shine. Ah, oh, that sounds lovely. And I'm just going to get her like a romance book. Let her, let her test it out. Wands of Desire. Untamed Treachery of the Heart. The Wolf Next Door. Yeah, let's get that one. She bought $115 worth of books. All right, so she made it to... It's windy in a mug over here. It's so pretty. We are in Willow Creek and we have made it to the Wayward Bar. It's a two level bar. It's kind of outside. It's also considered a bubble bar. I'm going to go ahead and let her order a drink. Let's order her favorite drink. I don't know if I changed that yet, but I think I changed it. And it should be a Long Island iced tea. All right. So she's just waiting for a drink. And I wanted to come do this little tree thing. I don't think I ever really done it before. So we're going to do that too. Yep, it's the Long Island. Might as well introduce yourself to Moira. Oh, look, it's a werewolf. No, thank you. I think I found my best friends and it's not you. But thanks for offering though. Oh, girl, what you make? What's this? <gasps> Cauliflower lime rice? Uh, yeah, stealing. We're just here to steal the food from the caterers, you know what I'm saying? And get a little drinky drink in. We gotta watch our money. She only got $88 now. Oh, look, it's Hun. Hey, Hun. To the bathroom we go. Oh, thank you for not following me into the bathroom like other people usually do. Who's this? Ooh, Nina Caliente. Oh, there is music. I didn't know there was music. We know Hun. Hun's kind of cute. He's got a little vampire vibe to him. The skin of a killer, Bella. Girl came out here full attire. She said, it's cold. She said it is cold outside. Why am I yelling at her? Oh. Child, I let her do one mean thing and she been like, I'm going to be mean until the end of time. Anywho, it was nice talking to you. We are going to go to this tree. First, we're going to dig this up. First, we're going to dig for treasure. And then we're going to go to this tree. And view this tree. Oh, Lord. What better way than to try to go inside the tree than to do it while you're drunk so you don't remember that you went inside a tree? Oh. Yeah. Oh. Okay, girl. Speed it up. So we're just gonna speed this up. I'm not gonna sit here and wait for it, you know? How many times do I have to view it? Open up, tree, open up. Let's water the tree. One goth boy. Oh yeah, we're selling that. Ooh, chat about roots. And then we're going to explore. Let's go. It opened. It has opened. Oh, yeah. All right. She went in there. Now we just got to wait for the options to pick up. So, okay. 
This trunk is a lot bigger than anticipated. It's dark, but somehow not scary. A faint glow is the only light. A rolling burble, the only sound. I'm going to follow the light. So we did follow the light first. <laughs> Uh, well, let's try it again. So we're not following the light. We're going to follow the sound. Okay, so let's follow the sound. Adrena delves a bit deeper and a bit darker. A soft flesh tells her that she has just dressed, stepped into a shallow stream. Okay, so let's go downstream. Travel the glade. Wow. So we have made it to, what's this called? The Sylvian Glade or whatever it is. It's the little magical place inside the tree. Wow. Now, to be honest, I don't think you can do much here. Um, let's just get a look-see. Uh, we don't really want to fish. I use these flowers all the time. Is there anything I can collect at least? No, nothing. Let's go here. This is cute. I'm like hearing giggling. You hear it? What the f is this yo tell me I'm not delusional that's there I recorded it oh they're everywhere when you go in the tab mode this is crazy that I can't interact with this stuff. What was the point of putting this here if I can't go over here and interact with these things? Look, she's bored. She said, well, I'm going to get on my phone. I think Audrina is done with this. I'm going to have her come stand over. Look, I can't even go up there. I can't go over there. Like, go here. But I think this is a good little place to end it. I, like this this particular one is not going to be too structured. I'm just going to play and record when I want to play and record. And she's just living her little life, meeting people. We're still with the plans to overthrow the club leader so far. We have negative sentiments, so that's good. Marcus said he doesn't even care for her to be the leader. She thinks she's doing great. Nobody does. I mean, I'll talk to the other two people. But yeah, I think this is a good place to end this. This is AV Story, aka Audrina Barnes. And maybe next time we'll get a little love interest. Maybe not. Um, I do want to focus on overthrowing that club. So we'll probably do a club gathering or whatever, but that's all for me. So I will catch you guys next time. It's been me, your girl, your Deagle here, and I'll catch you guys on the next video. Bye, Becky.